Ghana is a developing country of 23 million people located in West Africa between Cote d'Ivoire and Togo. In the Tolan Kabugu district of Ghana's northern region, there is only one doctor for 150,000 people. Only one person in 20 can read or write, and two-thirds of communities do not have access to clean water. Situated in the Tolong Kumbugu district, the King's Village project began in 2005 as an initiative to promote literacy in the district communities, where only 40% of children attend school. Project director Pastor Ben Awusu Sechere describes the people the organization serves. Well, King's Village is a Christian partnership project um, working with different organizations to help alleviate poverty and uh, bring relief to the poor in the district of Tolongkumbungu in northern Ghana. It is a relatively poor district, in fact one of the poorest in Ghana. The people are mostly subsistence farmers. Their mission brought into health care after one of the project's pupils contracted malaria and died due to a lack of adequate local medical resources. Now King's Medical Center is the largest facility in the district which had no employed doctors prior to its introduction. King's Village employs a holistic approach to health and well-being, providing comprehensive medical care, clean water and sanitation, and intensive pediatric care for the chronically malnourished area. In 2008, over 90% of children in the village of Wuba in the Tolong Kumbugu district were found to be severely malnourished. They are very poor. They can't, they can't pay for medical services. So that has been the challenge in general in the north. That's why we are happy that you are, you are supporting us in this area. Direct Relief in BD began supporting the King's Village project through the BD volunteer service trip in March 2008. Seven volunteers brought their expertise to this program for three weeks, providing training and supporting infrastructure improvements that put the King's Village Project in a position to meet the long-term needs of the community. BD and its associates have contributed money, products, talent, and time to treating disease, expanding access to medical services, and improving lives by raising health standards. Over the course of the trip, 3,600 people received direct medical treatment. A laboratory was built and entirely outfitted. Five mud hut residences were built for families staying at the nutrition center. A blood bank was established. The Kings Village campus was wired for the computer network. School children were taught hygiene and nutrition practices. And 92 traditional birth attendants were trained. I think my most defining experience while I was in Ghana um, was during one of the medical outreaches. It was called, we called it the Overseas Medical Outreach um, because it was uh, a very lengthy journey. Once we were there um, was probably really the defining moment. We met with the chief of the village first off and he presented us with a welcome gift of, uh, he gave each of us three cocoa beans, which means welcome. Um, and he told us he was most appreciative that we were there. And also that um, no medical outreach had ever come to his village. So it just made me really appreciate and, and understand um, what we take for granted and what, how they have no access to good medical care. In two and a half short weeks, I think we really um, accomplished a lot and, and helped to make King's Village staff lives a little bit better and, and easier and also certainly um, help improve health care for that region. BD volunteers will return to the King's Village project in October 2009 to equip King's Medical Center with essential medical supplies, provide free medical outreach, train community health workers, and ensure sustainability within the community. The King's Village, in, uh, within this year, 
is looking forward to open the second phase of the medical center. Already the construction of the center is going on and within the next three or four months we hope that it will be completed. And it's uh, very exciting talking with uh, Direct Relief and BD to see how they can help us to equip the center. BD Associates will have a chance to support the trip through Direct Relief's website. There, you'll find opportunities to sponsor essential elements of the volunteers' work, like water filters, medicines for outreach to rural populations, and nutritional supplements. This service trip is a true embodiment of BD's corporate purpose of helping all people live healthy lives, and Direct Relief is pleased to join with BD in helping the King's Village Project transform lives and alleviate poverty. This is Kristen Brown with Direct Relief International.